Hi and welcome to Defemoremba, your daily ephemera inspiration in December. My name is Luisa Heinzel and in collaboration with 49 Dragonflies, I'm going to show you some easy ways to make your own junk journal ephemera out of basic supplies. Today's prompt on day 14 is tape and index or Rolodex card. Barbara, known as 49 Dragonflies, said to me the other day that I'm using not so much washi tape in my projects, so I've decided that I want to use these green washi tapes today. I have taken an index card from my stash, some music paper and some black scrapbooking paper. If you don't have such a special index card that has this little handle on the side of course you can also use some thicker paper and just cut this shape uh, and make your own index card out of a thicker paper i have cut this music sheet paper um a little bit bigger than the card is as you can see here here and here and here it's a little bit bigger, approximately half of a centimeter. And now I'm choosing the size of this black paper as well. And this is also a little bit bigger than the rest, so that it peeks out all around of this um, little thingy here. Um, I've just eyeballed all of these measurements. As you perhaps know, I don't like measuring with a ruler. Um, of course, you could also um, take one and make this really exactly, but I think we are making junk journal ephemera and it's totally okay to eyeball the things. I would like to have a little hole in the middle um, of this music uh, paper. As you can see, I've just cut that out with a die cut um, because that's the easiest way for me. But of course, you can do it like you want it. And if you don't have a die cutting machine, just take something round, um, make some marks around and then cut that out um, so that you have a circle in the approximately in the middle of this little um, sheet here. And now I'm gluing this music paper down to this black paper as a pocket. That means I'm only gluing it at three sides so that on the right side this thing is open so that I later on can put my index card in there. And there where the hole is, of course, a part of this index card will be shown through this round opening. Um, now I'm checking if this index card fits in here and as you can see it's not so much space in this little pocket but that was my plan because I don't want this index card to be able to move around in this pocket too much so um, that we have a really exact circle later on I would like to see something through this circle and it would be not so good if um, the card can move around too much so make sure that your pocket is only a little bit bigger than your card and here I'm showing you the next letter for my giveaway that I'm running here during this December daily series. If you never heard about this giveaway and you don't know how to enter, please check out the info box. All the information is down below for you. And now after I have traced my circle, I would like to glue my washi tape to this index card so that I have yeah, something like a little artwork out of washi tape. I have chosen different uh, washi tapes. I mean, they are different in, her, in their width so that this whole thing looks more interesting. Um, I've decided to choose washi tapes that are all green. Um, I mean, different shades of green, of course. You can also do that in a rainbow color palette or um, in oh, only black and white or whatever you like or what you have at hand. If you don't have washi tape, of course, you can also use some masking tape and um, perhaps paint that, for example, with some acrylic paints or whatever, and then use um, that to glue it to your card. If you do that and you use um, masking tape and also with washi tape, I can recommend to put some glue underneath to make sure that the tape is sticking really well to the card. We want to take this card 
out of the pocket and put it back there later so we don't want the tape to fall off from the card while we are taking it in and out perhaps you can hear some really strange noises in the background i have to apologize for that I have a really big construction site here at the moment at my tiny house at the campsite and my hubby is just um, making the new roof for this little tiny house here and he's on the roof and he makes this noise so hopefully that's not too crazy for you. I wanted to say that but I had no other chance to record my videos and make the voiceovers than now and it's a really hard situation at the moment so please excuse these really strange noises in the background um, to make sure that I um, can guess what I can see through the hole of the pocket later I have traced this circle and now I can glue my washi tape there um, like I wanted I try to get um, the smaller I mean the narrower more narrow uh, sorry washi tapes next to the wider ones so that I have a really cool mix out of the different types of, of washi tape um, and yeah I've I just glue the rest here to my card and when I come to the end and the washi tape is too long I just um, flip it over to the back side so that I later on have an interesting color spot on the background as well when I want to take this as a journaling card later then the back side is not so plain and then I've used um, some Distress Oxide Vintage Photo as I used it on the music paper as well to make that match really well. And here I'm trying uh, if this still <laughs> fits into the pocket. And I think um, it's some kind of a hard job to bring that in and out when the pocket is so small. But yeah, I mean, we are junk journaler. And if uh, when we work in our junk journals and when we use them um, it's some kind of a me time and we can take the time to take this card in and out carefully I think so um, yeah that's not the best thing here but I wanted to have this like it is and I wanted to um, try this idea out so I had to live with this effect that it's a little bit hard to get it out here I have chosen a little sentiment. This sheet um, with these stickers come from AliExpress. Um, I am not sure if this set is still available, but um, yeah, of course you can also cut some sentiments out of a magazine or you could also use, of course, a digital printable. I think there are many cool printables in this style online um, for example Barbara from 49 Drangflies has some really cool of these in her shop as well in the same style black background white uh, writing on top and the other way around as well um, she has them in English if you are speaking German uh, perhaps you are not watching this video if you are speaking German but if you speak German <laughs> Then you can also um, check out my Etsy shop. There's also um, an item like this in German. Here's the next letter for the giveaway. The information, as I said, is down below in the description box. And the link of this item with the quotes and the sentiments is also down below in the description box, of course. And now this looks like this. I think it's really cool. Um, and... In the end, yeah, I didn't like this original writing on top of this music paper anymore. So I wanted to cover that up and I also wanted to uh, make this thing a little bit more vintage. So I've decided to use this lace and I've just cut a piece of this and um, cut it around a little bit so that you can see those flowers a little bit better. And now I'm covering this original title of the song that's written with this um, notes here with this uh, music notes and um, I think that looks really cool and cute when there's something uh, with another texture on top of this thing I'm just gluing that to the back side so that I have every possibility to use this ephemera thingy in the end in my journal I can use that now as a pocket as it yeah i mean it is a pocket isn't it but i can also use it as um 
some kind of a flip out or put it behind a belly band or whatever I like to do. And to dress that up a little bit, I've taken this bulb pin and this little uh, guy here, this little insect, and I've just put that there. I think that looks really, really cute. Yeah, and that's my ephemera piece for today. I hope you liked it. Check out 49 Dragonflies channel today for another idea on this prompt. See you tomorrow. Be creative. Bye-bye.